everyone, my name is Georgi. I'm a director of engineering here at Dipinity. And I'm not here to uh, make a pitch of my project because I still uh, already have the funding from Dom. So thank you, Dom. Um, so yes, um, all these projects, all cool, cool stuff. At the same time, um, you probably wonder, but how did they start? Well, here it is how they started. Or maybe they can start, this next wave of projects can start this way. Well, um, developer experience is um, unquestionably uh, one of the important things here because uh, we want adoption and you get adoption by uh, people coming to ICP and building. Um, but of course, there's also some hurdles there. Uh, we've got our tooling, it's uh, all great, it works. But there are also some uh, hurdles there. For example, as um, you said, ba backend, Emilio, it's not just backend, it's full stack. So yes, yes, that's it. Um, so full stack uh, adds a bit of complexity there. Um, also, learning new concepts. I mean, let's face it, uh, most of us are lazy, me included. Uh, if you are not one of these, great for you. but. Uh, People are lazy, so uh, learning new concepts like wallets, like canisters, like smart contracts, and whatnot really takes time and effort. So why would you do it? At least, why would you do it in the very beginning? Maybe you can do it later. And um, yeah, I, I, th I think the most important is uh, how do you get it? Uh, how do you try it? How do you get started? Maybe just explore a bit. Click here, click there. Something works. Amazing. So. How is it? How it? This is how you do it now. Um, that's why we started with ICP Ninja, essentially uh, this uh, web editor where uh, you can try uh, and build something. Um, how you get started there? Well, we have our own uh, library of uh, examples and then click, opens an IDE, full-blown IDE. Um, uh, it uses the uh, Monaco editor from uh, Microsoft. And then um, you can start editing there, but maybe you don't understand anything about ICP if you're a first time user. So what you do next is deploy. A few seconds later, you have it running in mainnet. No gas fees, no cycles, no nothing really, just for free. Well, there is a caveat there, obviously. And the caveat is that uh, it's uh, for 20 minutes. But hey, I have a news for you, it's coming later, so uh, stay with me for a bit longer. And yes, no test nets, no, no faucets. This is real in mainnet. Um, focus is really on learning. Um, we wanted to create something fun environment, not too serious, not also um, too like joke-like. Uh, it should be a bit, creates the environment where you can do some fun thing, you can explore, you can maybe find something interesting for you, maybe you can stay with us a bit longer in the ecosystem. And um, yeah, I mentioned the uh, sample projects. Uh, we're always looking for some cool projects, so if you have some ideas, reach out to us and uh, we will be happy to review and uh, put your project there. And the other thing is, Today, the world is very much connected. There is no such thing as I'm here and this is my tool and then uh, I don't leave it. Um, well, some of you may think about your ID that this is the ultimate tool, but ultimately there is also a GitHub there. There's also your local. Uh, maybe you want to share it with some friends. So that's why we have created that. Essentially, follow, we have followed the mantra, no, no lock-in. Um, we want it to be many ways to uh, get into it and try it to get started, but also we wanted to give you the option to get out of uh, uh, out of ICP Ninja when you maybe uh, graduate. And yeah, a bit about uh, the history. Uh, it's pretty new, brand new. Uh, I mean, we started nine months back, about. Um, very much a bit of hacking, how does this work, would it work, would it not work? Well, it turned out that a few weeks later, about six weeks, uh, we launched our first version. And then uh, just last week, uh, which is the last item there, I'm not going to read through the items, you can read that yourself, but just the last item there is, it says that essentially, um, as of last week, with our new build server, we can uh, allow uh, let 
uh, the users with uh, accounts to uh, have the, uh, the ephemeral canisters deployments, applications deployed to mainnet for a bit longer, 50 minutes. So create your accounts today. Um, what's next on the uh, radar is uh, publishing uh, apps to mainnet. Now, yes, you can do that now, but it's an ephemeral canister or canisters rather. Uh, you can experience it, uh, but uh, then it dies after 20 or 50 minutes, depending on whether you have an account or not. Um, and with CycleOps, what we are exploring now is, and actively working actually, we are launching it later this month, is um, publishing to mainnet and then uh, manage your uh, account uh, application canisters with CycleOps. So check it out later this month. Um, Project Gallery, uh, I be we believe that everybody is a creator, so uh, also we believe that people uh, from the community uh, have better ideas than us. So we want to enable that, and uh, very soon uh, everybody will be uh, able to publish their uh, project, something cool, or maybe not that cool, and uh, put it there in front of everybody. Um, obviously more code editor and language support improvements. Uh, there's. Uh, Highlighting, uh, there's also dark mode. I mean, a developer without dark mode, how did we survive nine months? I don't know, honestly. And uh, last but not least is also trying with AI and uh, code generation. Maybe, uh, as another uh, presenter earlier today said, maybe caffeine AI. Maybe we'll use caffeine AI, the back end of caffeine, to generate some projects to get you started. So, cool stuff's coming. Um, this beefy QR code there on the right is actually our very short uh, feedback form. If you have some cool ideas, you can uh, scan it. Otherwise, just ignore it. But really, um, what's important is ICP, uh, we found a very interesting application of ICP, a bit unexpected for us, which was uh, workshops and trainings. Um, essentially, um, people love it in that environment because before that, we heard a lot of feedback from the community, from organizers of workshops internally and externally, that it takes forever to configure and then distribute some cycles and whatnot. And with ICP Ninja, you can start immediately. Uh, essentially, that's it. And ideas for integrations, we're always looking for those. Thank you very much. Um, ICP.ninja.